Hello everyone, this is Jake, and here's me killing Terramorphus in like 3-4 seconds. Once again with my Sandhawk, the plus B shield. It's freaking rocking, and obviously this is not how I'm gonna present this video for you guys today. And this video is supposed to help you guys how to beat Terramorphus, because whenever I first ever fought him, man, it took me 3-4 times to actually solo this guy, because this guy was a pain in the ass. Like... When I first fought it, I'm like, this is this boss is fucking ridiculous. Like I thought I was never gonna beat it, but here's an easy trick. So uh, there's few weapons do you will need. Well, actually, one weapon. The main weapon you need is the ruby, the fire SMG that you can get from Moxie by giving her like hundred thousand dollar. Don't like you can tip it, and when you tip her, she will give you a lot of money. It's good to have a uh, guns like infant pistol as well, but. It's not Ricard, man. It's just main weapon you need is that ruby weapon. The main reason being is because you need that weapon to regenerate your health. Uh, other than that, any other fire weapon brings snipers. Uh, also good to have rocket launchers as well as... The shotguns are not that viable, so rocket launchers, SMG, um, pistols, as well as uh, assault rifle. And once you spawn the Terramorphus, you blow the horn. Uh, there's a place you have to run you have to run all the way in the back uh, And you will see this rock and I have a hard time getting up here It's kind of embarrassing um, So when you once you go in there you literally just sit here You'll be you can't move any like a left side You'll be like stuck not stuck, but you can sit in this one spot You don't even have to sit you just stand in this one spot behind this rock and behind this rock you can pretty much you are pretty much invincible against the most of his attacks so there's a few attack pattern uh, attack patterns he starts up with. So I'm gonna go through each stage and basically I'm not gonna kill him with the overpower weapon yet. Um, I just want to showcase you guys how to beat this guy. Cause if I kill this guy like I showed you guys earlier in the um, beginning of the video, if I kill this guy in two seconds, what's the fun of that? And you guys not gonna be achieved unless you have that kind of gear with you. So I'm assume. This is for most of the people who doesn't have the right gears to like farm this guy. This is just to beat this guy up and get some loots. And I can always help you guys, so please don't uh, afraid to ask me for help. Anyway, this two tentacles does nothing. It throws a little projectile at you. It does nothing. As well as in the Terramorphus, it close at you. It's trying to whip, whip you. As you can see in the screen, I did not take a single damage. He did nothing to me at all. See, that doesn't hurt me at all, so this first attack is pretty much you don't you guys don't have to worry about. And this attack, the second attack, second tentacle is when it gets really, really annoying. So these are raw attacks. They hurt tremendously. Uh, they're slow, so you can dodge them. But you gotta make sure you don't move away from the rock too much, because otherwise uh, that could get you killed. Um, there's a couple times when I spawn, those things are started throwing rocks at me. I killed it, and there's health. Um, health like a regenerator on the ground after killing those tentacles I'm trying to go and pick that up and Terramorphus comes close at me and just whips me and like I'm dead So the best way to kill that guy is take out your SMG uh, This is one of the time you will need it because you will need to regenerate your health Make sure you don't get killed by the tentacles So you kill the rock ones as soon as you see it look at for the like the little eye parts and shoot at it To do critical damage and take down the tentacle fast as possible and the third tentacle is this laser beam. So some of the laser beams depends on the angle. Like this one is not going to do any damage to me. But if the rock is not blocking it, like that one right there, you it will be able to hit you. But like, so there's two tentacles so far that can hurt you, which is the rock one as well as the laser beam one. And honestly, those two are only two that's going to hit you. And that's, those are the only two you should be watch. Um, the rock ones, I find it more dangerous because they do like tremendous amount of damage like they can down you no time and once they down you you know what it's pretty much safe to say you're not going to be able to when you go down it's pretty much safe to say it's like you're not going to be able to get up unless you get really lucky and able to take down one of the tentacle with the rocket launcher if it's really close i don't recommend using a rocket launcher when you're not close because so you're probably not going to be able to hit it by hit firing it so just hit fire smg pistol also rifle, whatever you got so yeah the laser beam tentacle is going to spawn once or twice and they're like they're pretty much dangerous as well so please 
take them down as soon as possible. And tip I can give for the classes, Siren is pretty good, you can slag them, uh, slag Terramorphus and does more extra damage. Um, I mean you can kill Terramorphus by just using Phase Lock over and over again, it's going to take a billion years, but you'll be able to do it. The best class I can recommend it for Terramorphus farming is the Commando as well as a Necromancer, because those two classes you can spawn um, Turret as well as the death trap I think that's what it's called the little robot yeah those two can go around and kill tentacles for you and it's really really useful and helpful uh, Gunzucker is fine too um, but I don't really recommend it it can regenerate ammo and you can regenerate health really instant so that's pretty good but eh, those two classes I mentioned earlier is way better and Gunzucker and the Siren is not bad it's pretty decent as well and when this guy goes like a fire armor thing i don't think you can do any damage with the fire weapon i didn't bother with us shooting with my one uh my ruby because i didn't want to accidentally kill him because there's one more attack one more tentacle the four tentacle left to showcase for you guys sorry it's kind of long video but like his attacks are like four different ways and i just want to go 